YouTube video, I think. <laughs> Swore that kid in there said I spice <laughs> which is me. Okay, I'm in the city to meet Daz Black. He's a game art YouTuber. Um but I can't film with cameras so I'm gonna just film the rest on my phone like at the event there's still like an hour to it but we're just gonna walk around until we get to go in so I'm super keen I'm so nervous because I'm like meeting him I'm like what do I say ah, but um yeah You good? Okay. Ready? <laughs> you good? Did so someone step on your foot? <laughs> you okay? Okay, ready? Linda! <laughs> Next! Oh. It, it's a jump scare, isn't it? So when I was single, I should have used all of these for my Tinder profile. <laughs> See how far I got. I got any more? Now, that's actually, that's not too bad, other than give me the ring my precious eyes, right? That's the pinnacle, right, so far. Have we got any more? Fuck. Daz Games, and we are back with another horror game. Yeah? All right. Quinn, right? Calm down. I wasn't actually there dressed up. I was there behind the scenes just because uh, they run other events in the UK as well and we were doing meetings and stuff for future Comic Cons and what could I do, etc. And I left the meeting backstage and I met a few like celebrities and stuff. So I was like, this is amazing. And I walked out through the crowd, got spotted a few times, right? This one guy comes up to me, right? I, I smelt him before I saw him. Yeah, and he had long black hair, he had trench coat, right, in summer, right, really, really fucking weird, and he tapped me on the back with his long nail, right, I was like, I'm like, shit, <laughs> hello, how are you, and he's holding a shoebox, right, I thought, oh, I've had a good life, I'm gonna die, right, <laughs> And he doesn't blink anything, he's just stood there, right? And he says, <laughs> right? <laughs> says, Daz, I made you. <laughs> no, you fucking didn't. My mum did some nasty shit years ago, that's what made me, right? I said, what do you mean? And he's like, Daz, no, I made you. And with, yeah, that's the noise I made. 
and it opens up the shoebox, and there's a little clay daz in there. Right? I can see it's me, because it, it's bad enough, but also good enough to know that it's me. Little daz is in there like... And you know that, you know that reaction your mum has when you're a kid and you draw something and she doesn't know what the fuck it is? She's like... So when people meet me, I'm, I'm used to people giving me gifts and, and like tea. People always give me tea. Never had to buy tea since I started this shit. So I go to take little Daz, right? And he's, no. I made it for me, right? And then he runs off like Voldemort. Fucking... It's gone, right? And I'm thinking, why has he made that? Somewhere out there, little Daz is in someone's ass. Sure of it. Feel for him. <laughs> Do you guys want to know the weirdest part of that story? Because that's not the weirdest part. You really have to think about this one, right? So I'll tell you. I didn't tell anyone publicly, privately, nowhere that I was at Comic Con. So the only explanation is that he was just walking around with me in a box and just happened to fucking bump into me. Oh, oh, oh. That is creepy. Yeah. Yeah. I have to remind myself that that's the shit that pays my mortgage. <laughs> and another reason, final reason, why you're not getting a fucking P.O. box if this isn't enough, is I see everyone's fan art of me, right? Some of it's good, right? And I look at all the other YouTubers and their fan art, and mine is shit, right? <laughs> Get home. I have always wanted to try stand-up comedy, and I was never like, brave enough to do it. You guys have not only helped so many of my dreams come true, but you have sold out Australia. And I want to thank you so much. Thank you so much. And I, I, I no disrespect to any other YouTubers, but I swear to God, no one, not one YouTuber loves his fucking fan base as much as I love mine.